Hello, this tutorial is all about Python setup in Azure function app. Some time ago, I created the Azure function Python setup and custom packages tutorial, but later on Microsoft changed their platform setting and introduced runtime versions or frameworks. So in this tutorial, we are going to fix that problem. So okay, go to the create resource and compute and function app and provide here the app name and all the information to create your Azure function app and you can see that you have only available .NET and Java options okay let's create the azure function app in a while it will create azure function app go to function app and inside click on the function app to see and now create a new function when you will create on new function it will show you this ui okay if you click on this uh, portal option then you will see these three templates whether you can select webhook plus api or go to more templates you will be only directed to dot net or c sharp based azure function so let's create a function and see here you have http trigger template and you will not see anywhere the language option to change to python or anything else so just create and it will basically create the function in c sharp because c sharp is the supported a language as a default by default so this function is running basically okay now click on the function and platform inside the platform you will see these there are two runtime versions one and two right now two is selected click on the function and remove the function and go back again to the platform and now you can change because if there is an ex existing function you cannot change the version uh, runtime version okay now again click and you can see different ui create custom function and now enable the experimental language support you can see the python and now you can create the python function from here so in this way by changing the runtime version from the function app properties you can create python function in current setup as well